I would to have a cold shower. Of course, I'm not looking for that. And I'm fucking making a video about this shit. I woke up in the morning, six thirty, from the six thirty-five. That was amazing. A cold shower? Fuck yeah. I don't know, bro. All I gotta say is, I didn't look forward to it, and I did it, and I feel amazing. Yeah. Eat food. Now I'm going to the calisthenics park. See you then. And you, you just woke up. Don't feel like anything. You're a pussy ass bitch. And you know what I say to myself? What if I woke up and I went on a run? Gotta have that mindset. Stay hard. Hello everybody. This is three days after I recorded the initial video. As you saw, I put it in the video. Now, let's talk about morning routines and such. You don't have to copy mine. You can use mine. You can improve on it. You can make it your own version of it. Let's say, okay, meditation. Not everybody sits up straight in a meditative position with their legs crossed. No, they don't do that. Some people like to lay down, sit up straight, you know, what's best for them, what's most comfortable for them to perform the meditation the easiest. Same with morning routine. My morning routine starts at 6. I'm in the shower at 6. No, doesn't start at 6. 6.30. 6.35, I'm in the shower. When I'm finished with showering at 6. 40 or 645 I think it was 645 then I'm outside at 7 after eating also my food at 
No, I don't think. No, 7.30 was when I went outside. Okay, I, I'm not sure, okay? I'm not edit the video just yet. What I'm trying to say is you can add and subtract what is necessary for you. Maybe you don't want to fucking take a cold shower. That's your opinion. You're just a pussy ass bitch and you don't want to do it. Of course. I don't care. Listen, you can add a meditation, a stretching in the morning. You can add whatever you want. If you have a balcony and the sun's already up when you woke up, just go sit in the sun a bit. Get that vitamin D, my man. But what I'm trying to say is do whatever fits in your life. This routine fits with my life. Maybe it doesn't with you. You should at least experiment, use mine, use other people's morning routines, and you will see improvement. But a morning routine doesn't start from the morning. It starts from the previous day, aka the night before. The night before, what do you do as your night routine? Because you need to do that so that you can go at it next day. If you don't have that, you can't do it. My night routine consists of me going upstairs, grabbing my fitness equipment, doing some calisthenics, pull-ups, push-ups, squats, ab uh, exercises, and in general, cat raises and such. Uh, grip strengthening and then I go I shower I eat food because I need to consume 3,000 calories a day then I go and I sit down watch some educational content then I go and then I brush my teeth gratitude journal meditate stretch pray pray to God and read a book until I fall asleep. When I fall asleep, it's like 11. Yeah, it's late. I'm trying to put in little 11, like 10. Yeah, 10 is like good, but I can't. It's hard. Sleep schedule is not the easiest thing to fix by any means. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you have a great, great day. If you don't, well, what could you do? If you don't have a good day, well, that means you're losing in life. Do something that makes you a winner. The winner effect is real, it is true. If you win a boxing match, you're more likely to win the next boxing match. That's just a simple thing, okay? You did 10 minutes of meditation, that means you've got a great chance to do another 10 minutes, maybe even more than 10 minutes. Okay, your life isn't that good. I'm telling you this good shit so that you feel good. The bestest way, even if you're an atheist, I if you're an atheist, please pray. Go to the side of God. I don't care which religion you are. I am Christian Orthodox. When life is going bad and I pray to God, everything goes good. Because all of the burdens, God takes it from me. Let's say you've done something bad again, some sin. God will forgive you. And I hope that you forgive other people just like God forgives you. I hope you ask for genuine forgiveness as well. So, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching. And I'll see you probably in the next video. It will probably not come out in a long time, but I'll think about it.